good y'all welcome back to yet again another episode of j.i productions it's your boy j.i and i'm back at it again with another banker video for you guys as y'all can tell by the title and the thumbnail of this video we are going to be heading to mexico again um as y'all can see we're jumping straight into this vlog man we're already in the car um currently gonna go get some e at the good old heb um because we have no gas at all so hopefully we can make it at heb bro because the car just told me go fuel so let's see what it say on miles so we got 22 miles i hope i hope we can make it to the spot and i think i just seen lightning so i really hope that it's not about the rain and i really hope that the rain if it does rain the rain at least holds out until we do what we got to do in mexico because if it's gonna rain here nine times out of ten it's gonna rain in mexico you guys know how mexico goes with america it like intertwines it boys just pulled up and got gas and i swear i just felt a raindrop bro on my mama i just felt a raindrop bro yeah yeah, yeah. my boy gully pulled up with the whip got down you feel me I'll see. Hey man, y'all let me know in the comments below. Should I put the Z28 joints on Vader? I don't know, man. I really, I rock with them. But as y'all can see by the trees, bro. Damn, man. I'm just trying to make it hit. It feel real good right now, too, bro. Damn. I know this joint was going to eat, bro. But I'm not trying to get caught in no rain, bro. feels so solid but anyway um so yeah y'all as y'all can see <laughs> we are definitely leaving heb bruh um it literally started drizzling as we were sitting there topping it up gully was pumping his gas and i felt a raindrop and i was like no and like i don't know if we're gonna be able to catch it right now on film but it was thunderstorming my whole way over here. Like, not thunderstorming, but lightning. Like, there was lightning striking through the skies, like, while I was on my way over here. And I just pumped E78, bro. Oh my God. Y'all don't understand, it feels so good outside right now. I'm not 100% sure what the DA is, bro, but the DA is probably perfect right now, bro. Ugh. I'm so, I'm so hurt, bro. I'm so hurt. I'm so hurt. I'm so, I'm so hurt, bro. Like, I can't lie to y'all. This car feels so solid, bro. Good Samaritan. I let him go, you feel me? in tour mode bro like i mean not that it makes a thousand percent of a difference because it really doesn't but like unless you're in sport that's when you really gonna see the difference oh my god man i ain't gonna lie i'm not gonna lie to y'all man hold on we got a little tunnel action Absolutely amazing. 
absolutely amazing. She's for sure awake now. Oh, it feels so good. And then you get those shifts in sport mode that just oh yeah RK for sure oh I'm so excited for it to be a hundred percent done because it feels amazing as the car sits right now definitely feels amazing I can't lie it's just like so much more responsive so much more torquey like the throttle response is is perfect bro like oh thank you so much rk like honestly i know you're watching this video man i just want to say from the bottom of my heart thank you bro like legitimately 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 thank you bro because you took this car from pretty much a dud to one nasty feels amazing bro so thank you so much i can't i can't thank you enough and like i said this is just the beginning guys like we're we're about to tee up like i just want y'all to see this video um this video that my boy gully actually shot for me bro i'm gonna go ahead and put it on the screen and i want you guys to pay attention to the headlights in the video just pay attention to the headlights in the video So as you guys can see bro the front end when the pull starts the front end lifts up so high bro it's crazy it's literally crazy bro like it is literally crazy i'm pretty sure when i install the front skinnies on the car bro it's gonna lift up even higher because oh my goodness shifts feel so crispy bro oh my god and then you just hit the But just real quick, you guys, um, this is obviously not how I wanted this video to go. I really wanted to go ahead and get some solid hits for you guys. My boy Gully had some prep. We were going to do a whole burnout. Like, I was trying to get at least two to three solid hits in, get some solid logs and some solid draggy pulls. As you guys can see from the past videos, bro, like... RK really knows what he's doing, bro, because he has this car moving like it has never moved before. As you guys know, with Gully in the car, we did a 6130 for the very first time in this car, and it went 1129, bro. That night, RK was able to get the car to go 10 1. Set, I think it was 10 1 1, actually, yeah. It was 10 1 1. That was with Gully in the car. Without Gully in the car, things started to get spicy, bro. Um, I think the first thing we hit was 970s, um, and I was ecstatic about that. I was losing my mind. And then I left and went out of town on business, as you guys know. Um, but my boy RK hit me back with a whole nother tune. I came back and I flashed that tune on the car. As you guys saw, the car actually 
went 940s and then it went 980s um and it actually misfired it threw a random misfire um as you guys saw man so then sent a log over to rk man if you haven't seen the videos man just make sure you're tuning in but i sent over a log to rk he made a revision and the car went the fastest it's ever gone bro it went 890s bro it went 890s 61.30 now if you think about that the trap speed of the quarter mile with an 890 as your 61.30 your trap speed is about 124.4 miles an hour in the quarter mile. And if you do the math on that, which we did, as y'all can see, bro, 124.5 miles an hour is equivalent to a 10.94 in the quarter mile, bro. A 10.94, bro. The fastest this car ever went as it sits, literally as it sits, was an 11.7, bro. There's no transmission tune. I did not change port work. I did not change the intake. I didn't change anything, like anything at all. I didn't change the throttle body. I didn't change anything, bro, but the tuner. That was it. And as you guys can see, bro, the proof is in the pudding. The car is literally getting faster and faster and faster every time we take it out. And I haven't changed anything yet. So just imagine what this car is going to do once the new mods, the new round of mods that I have for this car actually get on this car, bro. Y'all just trust me when I say stay tuned. I got bangers coming. This car is about to look completely different. The Rotofab is going, like, just trust, like, just, just, just trust. The Rotofab's going, the LT2 is going. If you're interested, hit me up for this exact setup. You could buy this whole setup as a unit if you wanted to, including the throttle body. Let me know either in the comments below or DM me on Instagram, J.I. Productions underscore. If you're not following me on Instagram, J.I. Productions underscore, it's on the screen. Make sure you go tap in, follow your boy, because uh, that's where you get, like, the early release content for real, for real. But anyway, with all that being said, bro, we've got some big changes coming to this car, some big plans for this car, and you guys are gonna see the numbers. Like, y'all know me, y'all know I don't hide my numbers, I don't hide my mods, I don't care enough to do so, you know what I'm saying? And that's no disrespect to the people in the grudge world, because at the end of the day, they're actually racing for bread, and that's when stuff gets serious. Like, if I was racing for money, then yeah, of course, like, okay, cool, like, I'm not finna tell you what the car runs or what the car has, because we're racing for money no pop hoods let's just get it going you feel me but at the end of the day that's not the case that's not what i do i pull up to the track whatever's next to it i run it i don't care what it is win or lose i run it it's cool you know what i'm saying so that being said everything is going to be documented as it has been already so you guys get to see from entry level mods to basically pro mods what your SS, your 6 gen SS could be capable of, especially the 6 gen SS 1LE like I got, because we have some different components and parts on the 1LE than on the very, the regular SS, so it, it does play a big, big, big role. Like the gears are longer in this car. Um, we have the low side um, fuel, ZL1 fuel pump and the injectors, if I'm not mistaken. So yeah, yeah. Yeah, but anyway, um, with that being said, y'all, that's gonna wrap it up for today's video. If you're new to the channel, do your boy a favor, smash that subscribe button. There's so many of y'all that are watching the videos and are not subscribed. It may not be on purpose, it may be on purpose. Either way it goes, how about we fix it today, y'all? So on the screen, you can see the percentage of y'all that are subscribed and the percentage of y'all that are not subscribed and you can see the scale is outweighed way more on the not subscribe side than it is on the subscribe side so if we can go ahead and switch the tide you feel me and have more subscribe than not subscribe it would be so much to me if y'all could just hit that subscribe button that's at the very bottom of your screen but with that being said y'all that's gonna wrap it up for today's video if you're new to the channel like i said I'm not going to say it again because I don't want to bore y'all. But drop a comment in the comment section down below. Get this video a thumbs up, please. Let's get 
25 likes on this video, y'all. Can we get 25 likes on this video? If we can, I got some spicy stuff dropping. Either way it goes, I got some spicy stuff dropping. But can we get 25, 25?